So I think the ability to have a voice, to have an identity, to maintain that identity yourself, to have an immutable identity that nobody can just, you know, change what actually happened in your life, how many times you paid your taxes and, you know, how many times you validated something. It, it basically is a human right. And you can think about it like this, you know, that, you know, blockchain coupled with identity is much more of a human right than the Internet is. I mean, the Internet is supposed to be, you know, freedom of speech, right? But, you know, what we're seeing out there is we cannot even validate what's on the Internet anymore. It's impossible to figure out what's correct and what's wrong. So we've gone to, an, mm -hmm. you know, and, you know, from an information age to a misinformation age. And a part of that is also identity, right? There's basically validation and identity is lacking on a lot of the stuff out there. So it's it's very very fundamental, and it's yeah. In, in my view, it's it's probably the hardest problem, and we won't be able to solve that in the next five to ten years. But if we don't start working on it now, we will lose it. And then the only thing is right. left is a is a universal central authority, you know, an all-seeing AI or, or government who decides on your identity on behalf of you. And then it's not your identity anymore. It's who decides what you are and what you're capable of. And we already see countries who is having huge success with that direction. And then it becomes a question of liberty and freedom. Yeah.